everyone and welcome to another blind bag opening. Today we've got the Yokai Watch dog tag things, I guess. So I'm actually really into Yokai Watch right now. I know it's kind of a controversial series because, you know, it's another monster collecting series like Pokemon and Digimon and I guess Dragon Quest monsters and all that. So whenever there's something like that, people are always like, it's a Pokemon clone, which maybe it is, but I personally just don't really see an issue with that. I don't see, I don't really feel the need to like pick sides because you guys know I'm a humongous Pokemon fan. The cat is on the move, but I don't know. I just feel like series like this can coexist. I can love Pokemon and still be into Yokai Watch. So hey, why not? So here we've got Yokai Watch dog tags with plus <laughs> fun tat tattoos and uh, sticker card. Okay, look for shaped tags. I don't know what that means, but let's take a look at the back. Each pack is going to include one dog tag with epoxy finish, whatever that crud is, 22-inch ball chain, one fun tat tattoo set, one die cut sticker card, and a set checklist. So there's 24 in all, nine tattoos and nine sticker cards. I've only got three here, so we're not going to get anywhere near that. I will probably end up buying more of these because, like I said, I'm kind of into Yokai Watch, and there's not really cards to collect, so maybe I'll try to collect the Yokai Watch dog tags. I don't know, but these three guys right here on the covers are, I guess, kind of the mass mascots of the series. I see them a lot. I see them in action figures and plushies and all kinds of crud, but let's go ahead and open up this first pack right here. I guess it's a pack and we'll see what we have. So let's rip it off and let's see. It looks like we got... I don't even know who this is. I'll admit to you guys, I haven't really played that much Yokai Watch, so I don't really know who all the characters are, but I definitely want to get more into it and play more of it and watch the anime and all that crud. I don't know. I'm just a sucker for these monster collecting kid shows type stuff, so... I don't know, it's just something fun for me, but there you go. Let's go ahead and take it out of its little pack here. I guess we'll also look at the set checklist to try to figure out what this guy's name is while we're at it. So let's zo uh, zip that guy out. And if you guys don't know what a dog tag is, it's just a this shape type of thing. And it's got like a rounded finish. So I guess that's the epoxy finish it's talking about. It's kind of rounded right there. And we've got the ball chain. That's pretty much all there is to it. The back just says, oh, Noko. So maybe that's his name right there, Noko. So there you go, we've got Noko. And we also got the sticker. Let's see. Uh, this is just the checklist right here, so this is all the stuff we could possibly get inside. And then we've also got a tattoo set right there. I don't know if I'm going to be using those, I'll probably just hold on to them. I bet you you could fit that in the card sleeve, actually. And our sticker sheet is Eerie, which is Slime Dude here. We got these little dudes, and also the, I think this is the type symbol right there. So there's our sticker and our tattoos. Let's take a quick look at the set list right here. I think... Okay, they're just all numbered, but I think the ones at the bottom here with these uh, crazy looking patterns, I think those are the rare ones. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six rare ones, and then I guess 18 commons. Or maybe these are super rare, because these are the shaped ones they were talking about, so these ones are actually a different shape entirely. So we've got all of these guys, which are the commons, we've got these guys, which are the special ones, and then all of these, which are the rares. Now, you probably could cheat this and just like feel the pack and feel if they're a different shape that might work for the shaped ones. I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell though, because they are wrapped in their plastic, but enough talking, let's go ahead and get to our second one right here and see what we got. I bought three for all the different uh, blind toys I got. I always bought three of them. In the future, I might do more because they go by a little bit quickly, and I just feel like I have to pad out the video with talking and all that, but there is the... Uh, set list. Here is our tattoos this time. We got the little cat guys, fun tats, and this time we have tough. I guess that's the type. Uh, the, before Eerie was the type, and now we've got tough type, and there's the sticker there. And the dog tag inside here, it is this celery cactus looking dude. Let's see if we can open this up and actually see what his name is. Let's get you out of there. And his name is Wiglin. So another common one here that's totally okay, but there he is. Alrighty, he's got his little, uh, what is, what is this outfit? Usually they have these at like street side uh, food stands. Is that what that is normally? Uh oh. Cat, what are you doing? They might try to go for the attack here. Here, you can, you can play with this. I'm going to go ahead and open the last one here and see what our last dog tag is. Oh, look at that, guys. It looks like we got a rare one. It looks like well, pretty much the mascot. Not quite the mascot. The ghost guy is the main one, but he's one of the main guys. And they don't have the name on the back right here. Oh, there you go. It is Jibanyan. Banyan is his name. It's kind of small right there, but there it is, and it's got the little heart symbol. So there is our rare one. I'm actually pretty excited to get at least one of these guys because there's six of them to get. So I guess based on there being 24 in the entire set, being that there's six of these, is probably about a one in four shot to get them. So that's actually pretty gosh dang awesome. So there's our third guy. I guess that's the best one we got. And let's go ahead and take a look at our stickers this time. Here are our fun tats. We got the tough type symbol once again. Some of the little cat dudes, and here is a heartful type with the sticker, and we got this guy. 
Yeah. All right, guys. So those are our three dog tags. I'll probably be doing more of these in the future to try to get more of them. But I think that I'm going to wait until I've had time to beat the game and get a bit more familiar with Yokai Watch before I really dive too much deeper into this. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will mention... Oh, I think the cat likes this. But I will mention that I have decided I will be doing more of those Marvel ones to try and get Thor. I just have to take the time to get back to the store to actually, uh, to actually get that. But we'll do that eventually. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.